Dominican Republic. comes from Venezuela and she asks what is the most precious gift you have given to someone Según mi abuela fue una carta que yo le escribí cuando ella tuvo una enfermedad y toda la vida me lo ha agradecido y me llena de emoción porque siempre me pues me lo me lo hace sentir y siempre creo que no es lo material sino el sentimiento que tú le pones a las cosas According to my grandma it's a letter According to my grandma, it's a letter that she wrote to me when I was young, and it makes, all, makes me always feel very emotional, because it's not what you write, but it's the feeling you put behind it. Okay. Do I feel short or what? <laughs> oh, no, not at all. Yeah, a little. When you were a little girl, you helped out at your grandmother's store. I did too. What did you do? Okay, well, I'm going to do this Spanish. Um, bueno, mi abuelita tenía una tienda en un, en un centro turístico y pues imagínate tú, una niña de, de 8 años vendiéndole café a los turistas sin casi saber hablar inglés. Well, we y pues yo, come, come, buy from my grandma's store. Y pues imagínate, tratando con mi primer trabajo. Well, you can imagine my grandmother had the store over at this tourist place, and I was just a little eight-year-old girl, and you can imagine I was telling the tourists, come on over and get some coffee. That was my first job. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. one year ago. 18-year-old Amelia Vega was crowned Miss Universe 2003, making history as the first title holder from the Dominican Republic. As a role model for young women all around the globe, Amelia's calendar was suddenly filled with the kind of itinerary she'd only dreamed about. TV and radio interviews, autograph sessions, and opportunities to meet leading players in politics and entertainment. Amelia was passionate and determined to use her profile to champion many causes. Working with such organizations as the Global Health Council and AMFAR, Amelia traveled the world extensively, visiting children's hospitals and raising funds for AIDS prevention care and treatment programs. For all her incredible work as a Goodwill Ambassador, she was given an award of recognition by the President of the Dominican Republic. It's been a year full of enormous accomplishment for Amelia, and one she'll remember for the rest of her life. Ladies 
and gentlemen, the reigning Miss Universe, Amelia Vega. like always what does it feel like what goes through your mind when you see just a little bit of what you've done this year oh my god it's been just so fast a beautiful year amazing experiences countries cultures people thank you Miss Universe organization this is oh my god what all girls just dream about thank you very much <laughs> Amelia what did it feel like that moment last year when they put the crown on your head and you won. I remember. Ah, uh, I did too. Believe me. <laughs> my God, it was just thinking about my country, all the people that just give me all that support. Imagine them jumping, having the first uh, Miss Universe crown. There's my flag. Mwah. Thank you. Thank you, my country. They give me all that hope. And God, I just think about him. I said, give me that light. And he did. Amelia, he deserve it. I will never forget how I felt. At that moment. How's that? Like Napoleon. <laughs> yeah. Thank oh, you, Amelia. But you're so cute. Oh, thank you. Great job, Amelia. Thank Muchas you. gracias, Amelia. And now, ladies and gentlemen, Amelia Vega will take her final walk as the reigning Miss Universe. Tonight, I'm closing one of the most beautiful chapters in the book of my life. This past year, I have had the opportunity to visit and learn not only about different countries and cultures, but also about my own inner being. My deepest thanks go to the many organizations I have worked with throughout the year. I will never forget the wonderful patients who have enriched my heart forever. Thank you to Elkis Reyes, Manuel Lirio, and the Miss Universe organization for putting me on a path that most young women only dream about. To my family, my mom, Patricia Polanco, my father, Dr. Alto Vega, and my grandmother, to the Dominican Republic, my deepest thanks for allowing me to represent you all. Each one of you will always be present in the new chapter of my life. Ah, oh, this gorgeous Amelia Vega.